Hello everybody and happy Monday. Today we are going to talk about eating and healthy eating choices for our Mindfulness Monday video. And I want to tell you to eat cake. So withholding things like desserts, um, ice cream, cake, brownies, all those yummy treats that we desire or we crave, when we withhold those things from ourselves, we often tend to overeat when we do allow them. Or those are the things that we go to when we are emotional and we binge eat or emotional eat. So don't withhold that stuff from yourself on a regular basis. Yes, you need to be mindful of your healthy eating habits and your healthy choices, but when we withhold those things all the time and use them as rewards, then those rewards can get out of hand. So today's mindfulness exercise is a mindful eating exercise, and I just wanna talk a little bit about what mindful eating is. Mindful eating is not a diet. It is eating with awareness, and it uses a form of meditation called mindfulness, which helps you acknowledge and manage your emotions and your physical sensations. Using this approach, this mindful eating approach, will help you to reach a state of full awareness to your experiences, to your cravings, and to the physical cues of when you are full. And you can use that while you're actually eating. So practice using all of your senses whenever you're eating and when you're choosing your food selections so that you are choosing foods that are both satisfying and nourishing to your body. All right, practicing mindful eating includes or it involves acknowledging that there is no right or wrong way to eat, accepting that there are different degrees of awareness surrounding your experiences with food and your eating habits. Accepting that everyone's eating experience is unique and personal to them, and it changes potentially based on who you're around, what environment you're in, and what you're eating. It involves giving your full attention to the food that you are eating, to the moment of eating in the moment, in order to avoid overeating and emotional eating. It involves recognizing how and why you make choices involving food and what foods you choose. Developing healthy habits in the selections of the foods that you choose to improve your overall health and well-being. And lastly, it involves promoting healthy balance when involving food in your life. Okay, so for today's exercise, I want you to select a snack. Now, I would say select a healthy snack like fruits or raw vegetables, cheese and crackers, hummus, those type of things, but select a snack that you would typically that would typically be your go-to. And I want you to spend a few minutes focusing and eating that snack. I want you to concentrate while you're eating and focus on things like what does the food look like? What does it smell like? What does it feel like? What does it taste like? You're gonna take in the food with all of your senses. And then ask yourself, how does the food feel when I eat it and how does it make me feel when I eat it? Why did you select that food? Does it help you emotionally? Does it help you physically? Do you feel better after you eat it or while you're eating it? Now, once you have done that, and I know you haven't done it while we're watching this video, but do that at some point today. And then once you have done that, I want you to take a few minutes to journal the experience. Answer those questions that I wanted you to think about. How does it make me feel? What does it smell like? What does it taste like? What does it feel like? How does my body react to it? Answer those questions. And then after you've reviewed that, I want you to make a list of foods, healthy snack foods, that you can choose when you are feeling stressed, depressed, any of those times where you would reach to food for emotional stability or emotional comfort. And then utilize that list, put it on your refrigerator as a reminder to select something from that list when you're feeling like you need an energy boost or an emotional boost. All right, remember there is no wrong way to eat. 
but making healthy food choices can make a huge difference in your overall health, both physically and mentally. That doesn't mean you can't enjoy a slice of cake, a brownie, a cupcake, a bowl of pudding, or whatever your sweet tooth craves and desires. Just be mindful of your choices and make sure that you are reaching for those healthier snacks more often than you are the undesirable choices, health choices. And when you restrict yourself to the point of denying those things, cake, ice cream, whatever it is, be mindful that you may tend to overeat or binge eat those things if you become emotional. So when you are craving it, allow yourself to have some. If you're craving those things on a regular basis, maybe reduce the amount that you're eating when you're craving them and eventually you won't be craving them every day. Please comment below and let me know what healthy snacks you are gonna reach for the next time you are feeling emotional, stressed, anxious, or just need that extra snack throughout the day. All right, everybody, that is Mindfulness Monday. Eat cake. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please click like and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget, if you want to be alerted every time I post a video, click on that little bell below. All right, everybody, have a great day, and until next time, stay mindful.